Okay, ladies and gentlemen, here's what I want to do. I want to explain to you how we're going to do our construction assignment. Now, our constructions assignment is where you're going to create each of the constructions that we've been talking about in our constructions modules. You're going to need to do the construction, just as you see me have here. You're going to need to take a picture of that construction. You may do that with your own personal camera device, if you so choose. Click here. And once I have a picture taken of it, I can simply share that file. And normally, I can share it directly with my Google Drive account. So I would simply go to Google Drive as one of the apps on my phone and save it and upload it to Google Drive. And so every time I do a different construction, I can simply take the picture send it to my Google Drive. Now, if you're in the classroom and if you have access to your Chromebook, that's even easier <clears throat> because you simply take your Chromebook and at this point, you take your Chromebook and you go to Apps. And from your apps, you go down and grab the camera. And the, whereas yours at school have a flip over camera, I have to aim my camera. And so I'm going to aim my camera I'm going to aim my camera, take a picture of it, and again, put it right onto your Google Drive. Because when you save that picture, it can be saved directly to your Google Drive. Once you have those pictures on your Google Drive from either your Chromebook or your own cellular device, you can simply go to uh, Google Slides and create a Google Slide and just input those pictures. So, for example, I have a slideshow going up here. I'm going to add a new slide. I'm going to insert a picture. And I'm going to insert either from my Google Drive where I have my pictures or if I need to, if I have them somewhere else, I can upload them directly. And as soon as I upload them, it will allow it to be put right inside my Google Slides, and it can be part of my slideshow. So what you're going to end up with is you're going to end up with copying a segment, copy an angle, bisect a segment, bisect an angle. You'll also end up with each of the centers. And as you can see, here it is. Once I'm done, I can simply go through and do a present on it. Now, additionally, we can even do a screencast. And the screencast is you simply going through your constructions and explaining. So, for example, my screencast, I would go to my screencast-o-matic. Now, since I'm already recording, it shows that I am. But I would say start. I would say this is my construction project or mine and Mr. Moyer's construction project. And in our first construction, we're going to create an orthocenter. To create an orthocenter, we need three altitudes. To do that, you need to, from the vertex, make a swoop each way, and then connect the dots, etc. And you explain to me how to do each construction in your screencast. When you're done, you would simply go up to screencast, you would press stop, and upload it to YouTube, and I'll provide you a link on where to put it in a Google form. So... You need to create your constructions, you need to take a picture of your constructions, put it on Google Drive, use that to create a Google slideshow, and even a screencast. So I think everybody can do that. We're going to take a little time in class. We'll also have some time out of class to get it accomplished. So with that, that is your assignment.